Welcome everybody to Holiday Racing Season 7 Event Number 15. We are back and we're ready for our final brown track event of the week before we go back to the orange track for the rest of the weekend. Alright everybody, let's go ahead and get this brown track event started. I am tired, so... Here we go. We've got Birdo Trevino and Monster Mo Rottweiler versus Buckfin23 and Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Let's get this event underway. Oh man, that board. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles hits the karate board and Monster Mo Rottweiler will get the Next win. Next up, we've got Shelton J. Plankton and Plankton Monster Truck versus Monster Jam Weekly Updates in Dragon. And Plankton Monster Truck will get the win. Next up, we've got Larry Lobster and Crustacean versus Racket at 17 in Stone Crusher. Stone Crusher will go on a bicycle and crash, and Crustacean will get the win. Next up, we've got Caleb Lund, Soldier Fortune Ice versus Twin Monkey in Holiday Hauler. Oh, and Holiday Hauler with a little slap wheelie will get the Next win. Next up, we have Karen and Blue Thunder Ice versus Moss Jam Extreme in Vixen. Vixen had a great fast pass going. If he could have kept it straight, he could have gotten the win. It looks like your winner is going to be Blue Next Thunder Next up, we've Ice. got Moss Jam California Northern Nightmare versus Scrap in Prowler. Uh, it looks like Northern Nightmare with the Jersey Barriers in Prowler will Next get the up, win. Next up, we've got the Cameron 9785 Monster Mutt versus Zona Monsters in Bad Company Ice. Bad Company Ice had the lead. Could not get the block, but it looks like Bad Company Ice will barely sneak past Monster Mutt for the win. Great job by Zona Monster. Next up, we've got Monster Truck Sid and Walmart Museum Truck versus SpongeBob SquarePants and SpongeBob Monster Truck. And Walmart Museum Truck will get the win. Next up, we've got Bullseye and Roger Dodger versus Squidward Q Tentacles and Squidward Monster Truck. Ooh, great effort and great try by Bullseye. That was a really great pass, but Squidward will get the win. Next up, we've got Mohawk Warrior 001 and Bigfoot versus Rigs of Rods, SMTV, and Glaze Machine. Glaze Machine trying to get a crash walk, but it's not going to work out as Bigfoot will get Next the up, win. we have not just Gabe and Earthshaker Ice versus Eugene H. Krabs and Mr. Krabs Monster Truck. Oh my, what a race! I believe barely, maybe by a tire, I think Earthshaker Ice will get the win. But that is close, but I think it is Earthshaker Ice. Alright everybody, I stand mistaken. We had to check this because it was so close and probably one of the most interesting races we've had in holiday racing history. I don't think we've ever had a finish like this, but by looking at that tire, Mr. Krabs will be the winner. Great effort though by not just Gabe. If not just Gabe could have maybe just rolled over off of Mr. Krabs and crashed and could have gotten the win. But wow, what a win right there and what a race. Next up we've got Moss Jam Kobe and Prancer versus Jackson Hughes in Grave Digger. Prancer got swirly and hit the Jersey Bears, which will offer Grave Digger to Next get the up, win. Next up we've got Barnacle Boy and Batman versus Sandra Colney in Snowhawk. Oh man, Snowhawk got blocked and Batman will get the win. We got us underscore Jam and Dancer versus Cats in Dasher. It's a battle of the reindeer out here. Don't know if we've ever had a reindeer battle before here in Holiday Racing. If we had one this season already, but if this is our first one, then Dancer is going to get the win and defeat Dasher. Next up, we've got Jonas in Blue Thunder versus Mrs. Puff in Higher Education. Well, that higher education, you maybe we'll get that block, but it looks like Blue Thunder will push past for Next the up, win. Next up, we've got Mermaid Man and Iron Man versus Lizard Gaming and Avenger. Oh, this is close, but Avenger will get the win and defeat Iron Next Man. Next up, we got Flying Dutchman and Track A Stars Grave Digger versus Aaron1234 Channel and, Hall and Team Hot Wheels Firestorm. Oh, great bounce off the Jersey Bears for Track A Stars Grave Digger. If he didn't get that bounce, I think Team Hot Wheels Firestorm could have probably gotten the win, but it will instead go to Track A Stars Great. Except we got SpongeBob Fan 23 and 2020 Christmas Stunt Truck versus Nathaniel Evans and Monster Mutt Dalmatian Ice. 
And I will get the win with the block. Next up, we've got Liam's Toy Time in 32 Degrees versus Patrick Star in Patrick Monster Truck. Patrick, I don't know how he may have tried to get a butt kicker off the karate board and will go up on a stoppy and crash, and that will allow for 32 degrees. Next to up, get we've got Nicholas Moore, Keesey, and Grave Digger Ice versus Squilliam, Fancy Sun, and Octanator Ice. And Grave Digger Ice will get the win. Next up, we've got Mac Bulldog, Mac, and Alien Invasion Ice versus Nicole Johnson and Tasmanian Devil. I mean, Alien Invasion going there and trying to get a block on the Tasmanian Devil were to get that far. And Alien Invasion Ice won't need the block as he'll get a win naturally. Next up, we've got Kitty Witty and Monster Mutt Husky versus All About Monster Trucks and Michigan Ice Monster. Who is a long race? Can Michigan Ice Monster get the win with a comeback? No! Monster Mutt Husky will get Next the win. Next up, we have. Monster Jam Collector 2008, Northern Nightmare Ice versus Spin Master Monster Jam and Santa's Monster Slay. Northern Nightmare Ice will hit the jingle, will hit the jersey barriers, which will allow for Santa's Monster Slay to Next get up the win. we've got Bakugan Dragonoid Monster Jam Fan and Bakugan Dragonoid Ice versus Perch Perkins and Chillin' Villain. Oh no, I thought Chillin' Villain somehow had that win, but it's not gonna work out. As Bakugan Dragonoid Ice will we got Nitro Dot Studio. We got Miguel Duyanez and Ice Cream Man versus Nitro Dot Studios and Son of a Digger. And Ice Cream Man will get the win. Up, we got Bubble Buddy and Mohawk Warrior versus Gary the Snail and Monster Mutt Ice. This is the final race out here in round number one. Who will go to round two? Ooh, Gary running a nice and straight pass, but it's not going to work out as Mohawk Warrior will get the kick off round two out here with Moment Yeti versus Birdo Trevino and Monster Mutt Rottweiler. Ooh, and what an upset out here as Monster Mutt Rottweiler will defeat Yeti. Next up, we've got Sheldon J. Plankton and Plankton Monster Truck versus Larry Lobster and Crustacean. Ooh, I thought Plankton had a block. Oh shoot! I thought Plankton was was almost like, like he tried to get a block, and then Crustacean pushed past. But it looks like Plankton will pull out ahead for the win. Wow, what a win by Plankton! We got Twin Monkey and Holiday Holler versus Karen in Blue Thunder Ice. In Blue Thunder Ice, we'll get the Next win. Next up, we've got Scrap and Crawler versus Zona Monsters and Bad Company Ice. Bad Company Ice has been running really straight and far today, but that pass is not going to cut it for the win as Prowler will move Next up, on. we've got Dead Panda and Captain's Curse versus Monster Truck Sid and Walmart Museum Truck. Walmart Museum Truck had the lead, but Captain's Curse with a speedy comeback will get the win to beat Walmart Museum Truck. Walmart Museum Truck is still rolling to try to get the win, but it just doesn't work Next out. Next up, we've got Squidward Q Tentacles and Squidward Monster Truck versus Mock Warrior 001 and Bigfoot. Oh man, maybe if Bigfoot didn't hit, go for the Jersey Bears, he could have gotten the win, but he will instead push Squidward to allow for Squidward Monster Truck to Next get the up, win. Next up, we've got Maxer RT and El Toro Loco Ice versus Eugene H. Krabs and Mr. Krabs Monster Truck. Oh, I don't know what is happening out there for El Toro Loco Ice. Is. He will just fall off the side and, El and Mr. Krabs' monster truck will get Next the Next up, we have Jackson using Grave Digger versus Barnacle Boy in Batman. Ooh, Grave Digger got a bit swirly right there, which will slow him down, and Batman will get the Next win. Next up, we've got Sandy Cheeks and El Toro Loco versus Us Underscore Jam and Dancer. And Dancer with a block will get Next the win. Next up, we've got Jonas in Blue Thunder versus Lizard Gaming in Avenger. And Avenger with a block will Next get the win. We've got Flying Dutchman and Tracky Stars Grave Digger versus SpongeBob Fan 23 and 2020 Christmas Stunt Truck. Oh my, and I will want maybe one of the biggest upsets of the season as I will defeat Tracky Stars Grave Digger as he's still wobbling there. On the roof, and it looks like he just about stopped. But wow, what an upset! So we got Liam's Toy Time in 32 Degrees versus Nicholas Moore Kesey and Grave Digger Ice. And Grave Digger Ice will get the win. Except we got Carol Harrison and Dragon Ice 
versus Mac Bulldog Mac and Alien Invasion Ice. And Alien Invasion Ice will get the win. Next up, we've got Kitty Witty and Monster Mud Husky versus Spin Master Monster Jam and Santa's Monster Slay. And Santa's Monster Slay with one of the fastest passes he's been looking for all season long as that'll be another upset out here. Great job for Santa's Monster Slay. Next up, we've got the Chocolate Driving Mechanical Mischief versus Bakugan Dragonoid Monster Jam Fan and Bakugan Dragonoid Ice. And Mechanical Mischief will get the win. Next up, we've got Miguel Duyanez and Ice Cream Man versus Bubble Buddy and Mohawk Warrior. This is the final race out here in round number two. Who will go on to round number three? Ice Cream Man came off the ramp weirdly, but will get a comeback win to defeat Mohawk Warrior. It is now time to kick off round three out here with Monster Mart Rottweiler versus Plankton Monster Truck. And it looks like Plankton Monster Truck with another fast pass will get the win as it looks like Plankton's been finding a Season 3 magic Next out up, here. Next up, we've got Blue Thunder Ice versus Prowler. I have no idea what happened to Prowler. It looks like she will crash and Blue Thunder Ice will Next get the up, win. Next up, we've got Captain's Curse versus Squidward Monster Truck. And Squidward Monster Truck with a blazing fast pass will get the win and defeat Captain's Next Curse. Next up, we've got Mr. Krabs Monster Truck versus Batman. Oh, Mr. Krabs Monster getting stuck on the Jersey Barriers will cost him the race as Batman will get the win. Who will go on to new? Next up, we've got Dancer versus Avenger. And Dancer with the Jersey Barriers will allow for Avenger to get Next the up, win. we've got 2020 Christmas Stunt Truck versus Grave Digger Ice. And Grave Digger Ice with a block will get the win and defeat. Next up, we've got Alien Invasion Ice versus. Santa's Monster Slay. Oh, that one, I didn't know it was happening. It almost looked like somebody tried to get a block, but it looks like Santa's Monster Slay will come out in the end victorious. Next up, we've got Mechanical Mischief versus Ice Cream Man. It's the final race out here in the round three. Who will go on to the quarterfinals? And Ice Cream Man was a big upset with the beat Mechanical Mischief. Wow, nice job for Ice Cream Man. Everybody, we've now made it to the quarterfinals out here. Here are our eight quarterfinalists. We've got Sheldon, inside of Plankton Moss Truck, we've got Sheldon J. Plankton. Inside of Blue Thunder Ice, we've got Karen. Inside of Squidward Monster Truck, we've got Squidward Q Tentacles. Inside of Batman, we've got Barnacle Boy. Inside of Avenger, we have Blizzard Gaming. Inside of Grave Digger Ice, we have Nicholas Morghisi. Inside of Santa's Monster Slay, we have the Spin Master Monster Jam. And inside of Ice Cream Man, we have Miguel Duyanez. Who will go to the semifinals? Will it be Sheldon J. Plankton or will it be Karen? As this is right now a husband versus wife battle. And Plankton Monster Truck with Sheldon J. Plankton will move on and defeat his Who'll wife. Who will go to the semifinals? Will it be Squidward Q. Tentacles or will it be Barnacle Boy? It's the battle of the big noses out here. Which one will move on? Oh my goodness, Batman just knocks over the karate board and it hits my knee. Luckily I am okay and the trucks are okay. And if that will mean Squidward Q Tentacles will go to the semifinals. Will go to the semifinals. Will it be Lizard Gaming or will it be Nicholas Morghisi? Well, it looks like Nicholas Morghisi may have gotten slowed down by the karate board and the Lizard Gaming will advance. We'll go to the semifinals. Will it be Spin Master Monster Jam or will it be Miguel Duyanez? This is the final race out here in the quarterfinals. And Spin Master Monster Jam will crash and Miguel Duyanez will get the win. Everybody, we're now in the semifinals. Here are our four semifinalists. We've got Sheldon J. Plankton, Squidward Q. Tentacles, Lizard Gaming, and Miguel Duyanez. Who will advance on to the final round? Will it be Sheldon J. Plankton, or will it be Squidward Q. Tentacles? The battle of the Crumb Bucket versus the Krusty Krab, and the Krusty Krab will get the win as Squidward will go to the final round. Who will round. face Squidward Q. Tentacles in the final round? Will it be Lizard Gaming, or will it be Miguel Duyanez? Oh man, I really wanted to see Miguel get the win. Maybe if he could have just gone a bit faster and not turned, he could have gotten it. 
But Lizard Gaming will go to the finals. Everybody, we've now made the final round out here in Holiday Racing Season 7, event number 15. We started off the night with 58 of the fastest holiday-themed monster trucks. And we're now down to the fastest two. Holiday Racing fans, are you ready to meet our final round contenders? Coming out first through Season 2 and Season 6, runner-up. Looking for their first event win of the season. He is a cashier for the Krusty Krab and he's out of Bikini Bottom. This is Squidward Cube Tentacles and Squidward Monster Truck. Versus in the other lane. Looking for his second event win here on the season. Out here in his rookie year in holiday racing. Representing for Team Scream and representing a two-time World Finals Championship Truck. This is Lizard Gaming in Avenger. Alrighty out here. Who will get the win and get the next 58 points here on the board? Let's find out and let's go racing. Squidward with a great bounce off the Jersey Barriers. Avenger going fast. It is close, but your winner is going to be Squidward Cute Tentacles. Great job out here for Squidward. Squidward hasn't had the season that he's wanted to so far this season, but he's hoping this man can help get him back in the game and help get him some more points as he tries to climb up to the top. Squidward's been so close to winning this thing so many times. He's had so many great performances. He really wants that win this season. So this is definitely a step in the right direction for him as he hopes to get a lot of points out in these next couple of events to try to get this season win. Next shot out for Squibbert as he collects the next 58 points. <laughs> Let's take a look out here at the points totals after Holiday Racing Season 7, event number 15. As we can see here in the top 5, after a struggle of an event today, Mermaid Man and Iron Man has been booted from the top 5 as he will fall out. And entering into the top five after a round two loss will be MockWare001 in Bigfoot with 581 points. And then in fourth place, even after a round two loss as well, will be Mom and Yeti with 601 points. In third place, after making it all the way into round two, well, round two losses out here for our top fivers. It will be Liam's Toy Time in 32 degrees with 611 points. And then in second place, after also yet again a round two loss, will be Kitty Witty and Monster My Husky with 687 points. And then in first place, keeping the lead after a, I believe, a round two loss as well, will be. Flying Dutchman in Track A Stars Grave Digger with 703 points. So the Flying Dutchman will be the first driver to enter into the 700 points out here. But it looks like Kitty Witty will most likely hit there tomorrow if he can race either pretty late in round one or make it into round two. He should be guaranteed to go over 700 points. We have some trucks in the 600s, some trucks in the, in the 500s, and then we have a lot in the 400s and the 300s. And there are still a few stragglers still behind in the 200s. All right, everybody, that's going to be a wrap for the event out here. Event number 15 of Holiday Racing Season 7. And that will be also it for the Brown Track for this week. As tomorrow, we will be returning to the Orange Track for two awesome events tomorrow and Sunday. So it should be awesome. So everybody, make sure to like, subscribe, ring that notification bell. So you guys are going to be notified for when more Holiday Racing Season 7 comes out. Alright, bye-bye everybody. Have a God-blessed day, and we'll see you all soon. Peace out.